ABC 13's Courtney Carpenter will join us now live from the scene of a deadly crash right there on Gessner. Uh, Courtney, what are the conditions like there and what happened here? Yeah, good morning, Samika and Rita. Yeah, sadly, a deadly crash here happened just before 3 o'clock this morning right here on South Gessner near Bel Air Boulevard. Now, what we just found out from police is that this crash uh, is not due to weather. But I do want to show you guys what this crash looks like, just the way that it ended. Uh, I mean, this car completely wrapped around this tree here. Uh, just a, a horrific crash here is still a very sad situation, though we did just find out moments ago from a that this one is not weather related. And guys, the thing is, for the most part, you can drive around Houston this morning with no problem. However, any standing water, any sprinklers that were left on, all of those spots are now patches of ice, which can be really tough to see, especially when you're driving around pretty much like normal. Uh, there has been some other trouble around town. That video you just saw uh, with police blocking off uh, the feeder road at uh, West Loop 610 at Westheimer because there was ice there. And then also uh, last night around 9 o'clock, HP responded to a crash at Bel Air near Bainway, also in southwest Houston. And in that situation, it appears there was some kind of a nearby water leak, water that froze on the road, and then that is possibly the cause of that accident. So I think this is... Um, the tough part. I'm not trying to tell you that it's just really hard to get around Houston. It's not. I made it into work just fine. But the thing is, when you take it for granted and just drive like normal, it's really tough to see those patches of ice. So be extra careful. Uh, you know, obviously folks left sprinklers on, water main leaks, whatever the cause of some of this water on the road. Standing water yesterday afternoon, now of course completely frozen solid. So the message this morning, guys, even though um, it's not icy everywhere, there are still going to be some icy patches uh, just in those areas where water may have been left on or water is leaking. So just be extra cautious if you're on the roads this morning. Reporting live here in Southwest Houston, Courtney Carpenter, ABC 13 Eyewitness News.